Whoa! Where is it? Where is it? Um, it's right there. Well, now, my cat would love a new toy. We'll just have to tell Cottontail we took her toy and lost it. No way! A good rabbit never gives up, and a good rabbit doesn't let his sister down. Come on, faster! We can do it! But Mr McGregor's legs are so long, and ours are so short. One of Dad's secret tunnels. It'll get us ahead of Mr McGregor. Come on! And here he comes. Time for you to do what you do best, Benjamin. I'm not so sure now's the time to eat, Peter. Not eat? Dig! We need to trip up that wheelbarrow so we can grab the toy. Radishes. You're welcome. I'll tell you one thing, though. I never want to hear another squeak again. <laughs> oh, a nut gathering invention, you say? It needs to reach up high. Oh, oh, and pick the hazelnuts of trees and gather them all up. Fascinating, but I'm extremely busy at the moment working on my latest invention. May I present the automated tidy apparatus? Hmm. Observe. There. That's brilliant. That's <laughs> better than brilliant. It's perfect. We could use this to gather the nuts. What a marvellous idea, Peter. Quite the young inventor, aren't you? Well, he spends a lot of time with me. <laughs> uh, let me just empty the basket. Oh. Uh, <coughs> uh, one thing. Uh, make sure it doesn't overheat. We'll be careful. Thanks, Uncle. <laughs> Automated nut gatherer. Well, well. <laughs> hey, what's the big idea? Looks like rabbits can collect nuts after all. Fire it up, Benjamin. <laughs> Made it. Whoa! That <laughs> thing is amazing! Woo Those are for you! <gasps> Hopping hazelnuts! It looks like every nut in the wood is in that thing! We'll be nibbling them all winter! Thank you, my radish-loving friends! Thank you! Where do you want to store them? Right there! I'll help you carry them down! 
No carrying needed. I'll just reverse the machine and blow them in. Huh? Huh? Um, maybe you should turn it off and try again? Don't worry. I've, I've got it. Benjamin's dad said don't let it overheat. It's fine. I think. Uh, uh. You're supposed to be keeping quiet. But I am being quiet. Um, that wasn't me. Cat! Away from me! <laughs> Aye, you like a wee fish, don't you, kitty cat? <laughs> if there's one thing I really, really don't like, it's cats! <gasps> ah, my oat cake! <laughs> Oops, excuse me. Rabbits! Thieving rabbits! You took my cake! You mean Mr. McGregor's cake. I stole that oat cake fair and square. Ha! <laughs> Tasty, was it? Eh, uh, it was okay, but everyone knows Jemima Puddle Duck's oat cakes are the best. Ha! <laughs> Is that right? J uh, Jemima Puddle Duck, you say? Hmm. Ah, oh, well, uh, gotta go. I wonder what that sneaky rat is up to now. I don't know. But you know Sammy Whiskers. He loves cake as much as that cat loves fish. <gasps> yeah, and she loves getting her claws into rabbits too. I bake your bakes, and I make it makes my yummy scrummy OT cakes. Time for sitting to do my knitting. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Hmm. Uh, excuse oh. me, oh. dear Mrs. Puddle Duck, uh, but you seem to have left your bonnet outside. Oh, oh my, have I? <gasps> I'd forget my own head if I wasn't always wearing it. Ah, <laughs> oh, are you sure? I can't see it, Mr. Whiskers. The bonnet was on your head all along, huh? see? Ooh. Now it's outside. Oh. <laughs> Oh, deary me, oh my! Uh, no visitors today, thank you. Ouch! And take your knitting too. <laughs> Got it. Cottontail's blanket. <laughs> yeah! <gasps> Whoa! That storm must be right on top of us. <gasps> That's not the storm. That's Mr. Todd. Well, hello. <laughs> Eeny, meeny, miny. Run! <laughs> Come back here. Run, 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 run like you've never run before. Run, run, run. If you catch a shoe, you're done to run some more. Quick, Benjamin! Come back here! Now what? I know! Uh, come on! Uh. Ah, finally! The moment I've been waiting for! Peter! Lunchtime! Back off, Mr. Todd! Oh, oh. oh. ah, excellent! Mm. Uh, very thoughtful of you. Keep me dry while I eat you. I don't think so! 
Come on, guys. What? Whoa! Wait! Come back, you wretched creatures. Oh. There you go, Cottontail. <laughs> And all of you. I never would have made it to the laundry and back before the storm. That's okay. And we didn't have to drink any of that chamomile tea. What? Uh, choo! Oh, sounds like you caught a chill. Oh. I'm okay. Oh dear, it looks like you've all caught one. You know it'll fix that, don't you? A nice fresh pot of chamomile tea. Benjamin, on the count of three, throw the toy to the cat. One, two, three. Yeah. Kitty cat, again. Cotton tail. We need a better plan. I have a plan. We go home? No, not before we get the cat back to the garden. And don't forget, we have to get the sprout. I know. We need some string, which luckily I carry with me, just in case. And we'll need the cat toy, Cottontail. Uh, what is she doing? No idea. Ready, boys? Ready. Okay, cat, back to the garden you go. Sound the Octo Alert. Octonaut to the launch bay. And got it. <laughs> 